Yes, what's up, one Sam? Welcome back and good day. Okay, let's talk YouTube. Let's talk this dark corner of YouTube and what's been happening in the last 24 hours, shall we? Um, first, a massive shout out to Dundee's finest, Bobby K. A man that walks the walk, you know, talks the talk, walks the walk, absolutely fearless. Um, when he when he had all them aliens, should we say, turn up in his manor, the man went down there, confronted it head on with just his girl. You know what I mean? Great guy, great guy, one of the real ones, fearless. And I was just, I was shouting to. Simon and Craig, I said, just get out of the manor. Just get out of the manor. This won't end well. Um, and take your begging bowls with you. Well, we'll get on to that in a minute. Um, John Smith. Um, now I like John, I really do. And this ain't personal. Um, but what started out as a roast, don't know y'all, ended in a bit of a damp squib. Um, John, I'm out of character now, and I know you're a great dad. You're a fantastic dad. Um, you're a great, great, great dad, but it was more of the same, wasn't it? You shouted at the top of your voice, you know, dressed up as a tree, and it all went down here rather quick. Um, we had PD, the ass of pain, come on and try and make a bold challenge to my main man, Yeti. And trust me, Yeti might not look like it to the... Um, the average eye, should we say. The untrained eye, but that guy can go. That guy can swing, mate. And if I was a betting man and Yeti and uh, what's his name? PD ever got it on at the um, Spartan Moors. You know, <laughs> my money's on um, Yeti. Don't forget I was right about the Danny Christian fight. I was right about the little Robbie Brown fight, etc. So, John, just... Keep it up. Be more relentless. Be more... <sighs> Just give it more. Just give it more wellies. Don't start softening after the first half an hour of you screaming at the top of your lungs, you know? This is me out of character. It's not personal. You're a great dad. You're a fantastic dad. You're a wonderful dad. You're a you're a hard-working man who gives all his wages to his wife, you know, just like every other simp, I mean man, you know. All right, um, Shadow Boxer, last night, no, well, not quite last night, yesterday, he done a live as well. Ma Jesus Christ. This, this guy makes the people in London look like they're, like, I don't know, a couple of bloody posh doctors or something. Um, he is living hard. Daddy Christy! Evening and got the money to feed the dog. Someone can buy me a vape. Oh, Jesus Christ. He was begging for eight quid after going on about all the usual YouTube begs like David and and uh, Craig and Simon, you know, travelled God knows how many miles to Dundee Sheriff Court, only then to uh, beg their naive nitwit viewers for some cash. You know, oh, it was very far coming here. We did it all for you. Yeah, sure you did. Your little stalking campaigns, you know what I mean? You lot are obsessed. We're all interested in um, Beggy, but not, not as much to go all the way there. Travel bleeding nearly 100 miles or whatever, 70 miles. I don't know. Further for some. It's just absolutely laughable. But yeah, the man just said he went to the co-op or something. He had 50, 50 euros was his word. Uh, bought some petrol, bought some cheap microwave meals and sat there dripping it all down that scruffy bit. He looks like, remember the Royal Doll book, the Twits? The 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 man with, the, with that scruffy, scruffy beard. Jesus Christ, he's lost his hair. He's lost even more hair than me. <laughs> and... Uh, Still yabbering on about fights that ain't gonna... Well, no, he started off trying to do a new comedy show and say he's a chicken and he's, he's this, he's that. Um, it worked in parts. He kind of... Um, he went out of character, you know, at, at occasions, you know, and then he went back in character. You know, it's nothing personal. Um, Shadow, we know you're not a great dad. <laughs> Did he, Christy? Oh, Jesus... The guy is living like an absolute tramp. Sat there on that scruffy chair with all the holes in it. Do you know what I mean? That green blanket. 
Do you know what I mean? The guy can't even afford a packet of razors. Big in for eight squid so he can get a vape. That's his training. The eating, the sleeping, the vaping, and the Guinnessing. Yes. <laughs> Where do we find them? This guy in a fight. How many months has he... Now he's you're talking about if there's a fight, you just turn up and fight. Why have you not turned up and fight? One fight. If you can, if, And I use the term loosely. If you can call it a fight with... Andy Goy, just, just ridiculous. And then we got that stupid sheriff who's come on looking even more stupid and thanking all the haters. Why is he constantly scratching? He's scratching, sniffing, swearing, he's effing and jeffing like a good one, you know, and just acting more stupid every single video. Yeah, you made me look me stupid now, haven't you? I'm the sheriff. Yeah. Absolute wally. Jesus. When God was giving out brains, where was he? Where was he? Bloody up scratching. Too busy at the back of, back of the queue scratching. Um, he's had a bit of a back and forth with Christopher, Christopher Murphy. Now, I'll give Chris that. He's tried with just about everyone, and he, on YouTube. He's ratted. He's, he's raged. And it's got him nowhere. Uh, he tried talking. The, the biggest mistake you can make as a YouTuber is talking behind the scenes with someone you don't know. So Chris Murphy has been talking behind the scenes with the stupid sheriff. He's left voice notes. The voice notes the stupid sheriff's used against him. The oldest trick in the book. You know, they never learn. And now the stupid sheriff. Oh, I can't be done with YouTube. Oh, I'm thinking oh, I might have to quit. You know what I mean? Um, you won't see me again. I'm not that old one. Oh, God. Um, yeah, so... We've, we've, I don't think Chris Murphy will disappear, to be honest, but um, a back and forth with the stupid sheriff is, you know, on um, Instagram, Facebook or WhatsApp or whatever, however you used to have been communicating, pigeon post probably. Um, that stupid sheriff, he really gets on my tits. Constantly scratching, snorting, sniffing. He's got worse table manners than bloody Decker. Yeah, oh, God, and he's just, every time he comes on video, looking even more stupid than the last time he looked stupid. And no, then before everyone else is, stop telling me bloody Scotty G's been act or Scotty G's this. I do not care. I do not watch. I do not subscribe. I cannot sit through nearly 20 minutes of Scotty G, even if I've sped up the bloody video, you know? He, he just, he just drones on, he, do you know what I mean? He's not a fighter, he's not an entertainer. Yes, it can be quite amusing, you know, hearing his delusions, but no, no and no. You know, the guy needs to get himself in rehab for six months at least, maybe a year, you know? Stay off YouTube, people need to stop encouraging him, yeah? The ones that were picking on him, who now feel sorry for him, conveniently, because they want to win the public over, bring Scotty on their channels. I mean, look, you got to be, this has got to be hard times if you need to bring Scotty G on your channel for clout. You know, you must be rough in it. Who do I like on YouTube? Apart from Dundee's finest, Bobby Cole, who always shoots from the hips. He's the real guy. You, real talk with Bobby. Real talk. No messing. I like Narrative Destroyer. Me and him think alike. We're both on the ball when it comes to the beggars, you know, and the beggars are still, look, they go all that way, they beg for money, people throw money into their PayPal, they're buying me coffees, they're super chats, when will they learn? You know, sure, sure we we're all entertained, interested in Beggy, you know, but, you know, I, I ain't going to pay for it, bloody hell, and then we've got JD Pope, talk about the coffee, what's your love, what's the scarts on, you know, uh, I was on to you all from the beginning, boy. You can't fall my mind. I'm too smart for your mind. Uh, I'm going to talk about mine for another 20 videos. Even though I said I wasn't going to talk about mine, guess what? Now I'll talk about the equalizer. Equalizer, I know who you are. I'll call you out and I'm going to talk about it and talk about it and talk about it. I'm going to make 10 videos a day talking about you. Time by the cup of show, love. Christmas is cancelled. Jesus Christ. I'm the... I'm honestly one of the handful of normal blokes on here, you know, good looking, nice body, 
attracts the females. Still getting asked for ID for my age when I try and buy some beers. Do you know what I mean? Or some f nice Hamlet cigars, you know? You know, the, the lovely... Never mind. Um, you know? And, yeah, I'm mixed up. And my views are plummeting. My views are plummeting because I'm not... Um, what's the word? Tagging all these degenerates in my titles. I don't need to tag Danny Christian in my title or Paul Dumbo Venice. Any any cod could do that, you know? I mean, Danny, look, he gets thousands and thousands of views for just driving around in his car being egotistical. It's the same old stuff with him. It's Sorry, I, I'm bored of it. You know what I mean? As for um, fighting trolls versus the real Danny G, I'd love to see... Good old Pablo smash um, the real Danny G. Another one. All mouth and no trousers. Something like that. Um, yeah. The real Danny G is a little, he's a little diddy man. Little diddy man. Lies about his strength. Lies about his fights. You can see most of my fights online, you know. 95 fights, 95 wins, all by a knockout. When I was in my prime, of course. Um, at least, well, 40 odd of them are online, you know, for people to watch and, you know, marvel at. That was when I was a real, like, real, like, like a ticking time bomb. Like, like when I, they used to put an opponent in front of me, it didn't matter. They was like six foot ten, you know, twenty six stone, you know. Obviously, you know, I used to, I used to go crazy. Just used to, t like, my nickname used to be the ticking time bomb. You know what I mean? But, whoo -hoo, mate, when I, when I go, I go. I just charge into my opponent. Attack! 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 I'm relentless. I'm all over. I'll smother my opponent. And that's it. Next minute, someone's face down on the dirt. You know? People, um, enjoy your Thursday. Um, I will speak to you. Unless something amazing happens on YouTube. This corner of YouTube, which it won't. It never does. I'll be back um, tomorrow. I mean, this is... Look. This is not, nobody take anything personal. This is a roasting channel, yeah? I'm, I'm, look, I'm out of character now. Um, I know like, all the people that I've talked about, John Smith, he's a great dad. He's a wonderful dad. He's a fantastic dad. Do you know what I mean? And an amazing husband, do you know what I mean? It's not personal, John. It's, I'm out of character now, but, you know, sometimes I just have to, like, shoot from the hip, you know? Big up, everybody. Respect.